So we finally got to the final chest of the storage unit. And look at this, it has a master lock on it. Whatever's in there is obviously worth a lot of money to these people. Welcome back to Treasure Journey with Jeebus, guys. And we're back here at a $320 10 by 10 storage unit. This is gonna be part four of this storage unit. So far, it has produced like amazing, vintage, expensive, finds worth quite a bit of money so if you haven't seen the other parts first make sure you go check them out so you can get up to date so we're gonna do part four now and i think the vintage money is gonna keep on coming don't forget to like the video subscribe if you're new let's get in it let's go through this big tote first because on the side you see that it says keep out. You know what? Keep out's a little interesting to me. Let's see. Keep out of. Keep out of your junk. I don't want your paperwork. Unless it's money. I'll take money. Um, is that all paperwork, really? Is this really all paperwork? Seriously? Seriously? Hey, hey, Seriously? hey. You're making a mess. I can't help myself. I don't want to look at paperwork. Let's get rid of this and do something else. Let's see, the little toe is more interesting. So we got a thing. I okay. always love things. <laughs> we got, oh, what is this? A basket. Oh, what happened to that? What does it say? Why worry? Yeah, why worry? Well, I'd worry if I look like this. <laughs> I'd be worrying just a little bit. What is I'd this? I'd be worried if I was dirty. In the crystal depths. <laughs> All right, but the picture's from 1983, so it could have some value. It's from a museum too. Oh, cool. Brandywine River Museum. You see that? That could have some value to it. Paper, paper, book, paper, paper, paper. I'm so sick of looking at your paperwork. <laughs> All right, we have a funnel thingy. Yeah. Some more pans. We have a lot of kitchenware out of this unit, which is good because it sells for us really easily at the flea market. So. Two more pans here, set those aside. It's just straight trash. Everything. What? Right. Not hangers. You know what to do with it. You don't belong here! That's right. That's right. We don't deal with hangers around here. We got a trash bag for them. At least they're nice enough to leave us that. Junk. Pictures will go over here. Um, a bag of bags? Yeah, bag of bags. And toilet paper. For Jeremy, right? Yeah. What the hell? Gold. Just yeah. like gold. Ooh, it even, even has some yellow on it. Mm, it's even used. I hope it's... What does she think is more valuable in the future? Snot or pee? Pee. Pee? Okay, let's hope it's pee. Uh, what else do we got going? Oh, I know where they hide all their money at. Oh, there's no money. And... Some tools? Is that a saw? That is a saw. I'm glad I didn't reach my hand in there. You see that? What a slice and dice me right open. That wouldn't have been a good day. Paper and some like house decor type things. Nothing really okay. that interesting. So that tote's not that fun either. So this tote has to be good. You know, third time's a charm. Let's see what it is. See, it can be bad when you have an empty. Oh no, it's in there. Salt and pepper shakers that are still full. One, two. Two, my bad. Salt and pepper. Um, bubble wrap, which we're gonna take. What is that thing? A cat. Yeah. Uh, what else do we have in here? More pictures. And what's in here? Oh, wow. Uh, what do you think this is? It looks like all personal stuff, but yeah. I'm not sure. More bubble. Whoa, what is that long vase? Hmm. That's a strange looking vase, isn't it? Yeah. It's all long and hard. Like Another one. Hmm. Weird. Well. Hmm. That does not look good for them, guys. That does not look good for them. Especially after what we found yeah. last time. That is not a good look. Not a good look at all. We have a little book here. Nothing. Yeah, that's not. This is not the winning tote either. But hey, we're gonna find look it. Look at that book. What book? I popped the top. My pop's a cop. So do we have a police officer storage unit? Maybe somebody in here was a police officer. That would make it a little interesting. But other than that, we got a bunch of nothing. Gotta close this one back up and we'll pop the next one. The next one has to be the good one. 
Guys, I told you this was a good tow. You know why? Because there's a receipt. Inside the receipt, we found the money. You know what? Ugh, we're loaded now because we have a hole. One dollar, two dollars, three dollars, four dollars. Let's see if we got any star bills or anything. No, nothing special, but uh, we just opened up that little envelope that we thought was all personal. We found money already. So you know what? We're going to go through this stuff and I'll, if we find anything else interesting, I'll make sure to let you know, but we got cash. Now we got a really heavy tilt to be so small. This one, get, get off. Ooh, let's see, this looks random. Is that a camera? Is that, is that a Polaroid? It is, look at that. An old Polaroid camera. Yeah. Um, wires galore. What do we have in here, let's see. Like we need more wires. Yes, we always need more wires. I home. Hey look, pocket deuces. <laughs> I used to have that. And this thing. A Go Gear Areas. Never heard of it. You what? Never heard of it. I thought you said heard of it. I was like, man, that's kind of impressive. <laughs> Let's see what's in this one. What's in here? What's in here? Open. Well, an old flip phone. Another handheld device. This one's solitaire. This phone. What is that? It's heavy. What's, what's in here? Gold. All right. Um, I hope you're right. Batteries. Okay. Boom. Did you drop? The batteries, they just tried to attack me. Uh, okay, we just looked in here. Um, these things. For a quesadilla maker, right? That's what it looks like to me. Uh, I don't know what that. Oh, I thought it was a quesadilla maker. I don't know what it is. <laughs> what is it? It's a replacement. I don't know. Like a plug. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, that. Plugs. Ooh, a phone box. It's in there. Imagine that. We have that old piece of whatever yeah. phone. New technology. Oh, it's not even in there. There's a receipt. You got any more money in your receipts? Nope. Camera's cool. You might have some value. Oh, man. House phones. All that's in the bottom there, look at that. It's like a bunch of little tool pieces and stuff. So, nothing else is really super interesting, but it's a good little box value-wise. What's up, everybody? Hope you're having a wonderful day. First, before I get into this tote, I want to say that we did pull out a few more totes, but they were all closed. Um, there's one with like two pieces of glass in it or just some random stuff, and that is boring, so we set it aside. So, this is the next big thing. This is the next tote that had just random <laughs> stuff in it. Um, so let's see what we have. So this right off the bat looks interesting. It looks hand carved. And I saw right when I picked it up somewhere, right here, it says India, but it looks like, like hand stamped mm -hmm. right here. And I don't know what this is for. Maybe to hold like towels or something? But I feel like this has some value, so we'll look this up uh, when we get home. Speaking of like stuff, we, we're gonna do a, a huge recap on the stuff that we find in this unit because there's a lot of hidden stuff in here that has some value. Um, and that's gonna be on the second channel, The Jeebus Family. So if you haven't already checked that channel out, please do. We're gonna be doing a huge recap. Yes, we're a done with huge all of it. recap. So this right here feels heavy. Um, but I don't see any markings on it, so I don't know what, like, that's made out of. I don't know how to set anything. I know. It's <laughs> awkward. Um, the, oh. Is that what I think it is? Yeah. Poor Gorda. This mm. is a, um, cat cremation casket here, mm. which will definitely be left with all the personal stuff that is over here. Poor kitty! Whoa! Ooh. Oh, I was dropped. <laughs> that would have been this bad. right here. Here's a little one to that thing that I just picked up. Oh, that's what it is. But goes to yeah, the big one goes into the other one. Oh, down here. That's, that's pretty, pretty cool. cool. This right here looks interesting. I, I don't think I've ever seen this big of a Bible before, and it has a uh, Nelson seven one two W on the side. And I know some Bibles have some. Um, 
some value or significance. Let's see, see what the, date. the it's year color, so that's not is. A good sign. Okay, so I see 1970, 1986. 1986 for hmm. this one and it was personalized inside so I don't quite know what to do with this other than probably donate it but let me flip through the page for a second you never know I always say that people always are like people leave money in Bibles we've checked probably 150 of them huh? never found a dollar I thought okay yeah this is what I saw in there but Aww. it is just a poem and this again. right here, yep, just a photo album of family pictures, which again, aside with all of their personal stuff. So let's find another tote. All right, so the next quote, tote <laughs> we pulled out, uh, caught our eye with the coach purse right on top, but I don't know how to tell if this kind of stuff is authentic besides a tag and a stamp, but there's a stamp and by tag, I mean a little paper tag or a leather tag that are usually on the inside somewhere. But I always have trouble finding this kind of stuff. And there's a heat stamp in there too. But I know this stuff is like faked all the time. And I don't think it would... Have... I might have found one real one ever. Coaches have been great. <laughs> yeah, but... Um, Louis now. Yeah, so not 100% on this. And it has some wear and tear on the top. So I'm not sure of the value on it. See what other purses we got in here. We have this looks unbranded. I hate unbranded purses. Yeah, unbranded. This one looks kind of cool. Pretty much brand new. There's no dirt or staining inside at all. And there's no tag or stamp on this one either. So unbranded. Ooh, look at this one. This is interesting. Ooh, Mickey Mouse. So this is a Disney themed one with a new. yep $37.95 price tag right on it. Brand new. I don't even see any fading or scratches in the whole thing. Mm -mm. So I mean it hasn't even been used even with the tag. I know some people keep the tag on. But no, given the inside. Bad. Brand new. That's awesome. I feel like we're gonna have a lot of interest with this one. So Message us on Facebook or We've Instagram. We've been trying to respond to everybody. It's been like crazy the last yeah. few days. But we'll, we'll try to get to you. This is Rossetti. And this one, I believe, had like decent value that we've sold in the past. And still looks pretty clean. Not too much damage. Mm -mm. A couple more in here. Uh, this one. Nah. Unbranded. And this one. I don't even know what that is. I have no idea. Unbranded. I don't know what that is. <laughs> so let's find something else to show. All right, so the next interesting thing we have is here. On the top, it might just like a regular picture frame, but if you remember, I think in the Jeebus family video, on the deep search, that the first one that he did on this unit, I found another one of these, but there's something hidden and that, that makes these really interesting. So this, these frames are only 10 bucks, so we're not gonna get much for the frame. But it is a box, and there's a hidden compartment in here. So let's see if we have jewelry. Oh. Aw. Hey, money! money. What who? What is this? Sure. I don't wanna break the thing. This is like a little pin thingy. All right. Um, there's, there's, one here, there's one, two, three pennies. We're up to four dollars, three cents right. today. Three pennies, but I think these things are amazing. I mean, I would want this right here in my house. So that's an easy sell at the flea market. So we pulled out this thing with like four drawers in it. It looks to be full of all kinds of stuff. Let's see if it's good stuff. These things usually we don't have. Is that a turkey? That's a turkey. We got a turkey. Okay. Uh, nothing. Zuma Deluxe. Beware dog. Ooh, we're Rock. gonna get that eventually, That's right? Scary German Shepherd. We're gonna get a German Shepherd eventually. <laughs> a dirty oh, word search. A what? A dirty word search. I kinda just wanna like open it up and look at some of the words. Yeah, we can't show that. <laughs> Enough said. Right off of that. Yep. Alright, let's see. Nothing. Another picture frame. 
going to make sure it's not silver again. I don't think so. Like the one we found was silver, that's money. Get out. All right. School stuff, batteries. Yeah. <laughs> not fun. Look at this one, by the way. I think this is going to be the good drawer. <laughs> what is this? Birthday book. I love Sue. Never mind. I'm not reading that out loud. It's a three letter S word. Starts with an S. Sue. Oh, what's that? New Testament. Nothing. Hmm. Nothing. It's oh not looking God. too good. I know. I thought this was going to be cool. This thing looked cool. I was like literally not being waiting to get into this eventually. And it's kind of sucky. In there. Really? All the good stuff was yeah, in the middle part. Lamp. Yeah, yeah, a headlamp. That would have been how. Ooh, look, 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 look. Money, money, money. Or coin. Is that a golden dollar? No, no cash value. Just random yeah. tokens. What are these buttons? Last time I found buttons are pretty good. Uh, <laughs> uh, this one says, I don't mind if you smoke. If you don't mind if I, you know, do do in your shoe. This one says, life's a beach. You know, everyone likes going to the beach. And then you marry one. <laughs> All the buttons we found in here have been pretty funny. What's the bumper sticker even say? Do I want to know? Oh, cat mom. There you go. Cat mom. That's for you. <laughs> Other than that, just a bunch of Chuck E. Cheese tokens and another another button. That's the same one. Another All right. Not very interesting like we thought it would be, but. We still have a trunk back there. So we pulled out yet another toolbox. And I like how everything in this unit has like do not touch on it. You know they had that fun family dynamic with siblings. Don't touch my toolbox. Mm -hmm. What do you think's in this one? Actual tool? Tools. That'd be all right if they're good. Ooh, let's see. So we got this thingy. Are those? What, this? Oh, on the left side. Are they bullets? They look like bullets to me, don't they? Yes. Really small. It's even smaller than a 22. I don't know what that is. It's like the same width. What's this? A gun to fire those bullets? Ooh, nice socket wrench set. It actually has everything. It does. I wonder what brand it is. That doesn't say. Did it say on the box? Um, no. No, it didn't. Hmm, some of these are worth good money depending on what brand they are. And a couple more tools. Ooh. Oh, that's a craftsman. Look, a craftsman socket wrench, and look, probably has everything right there that goes with it. Might be missing a couple right here, so maybe. I, I think what craftsman and snap on. Yeah. Are probably the best ones. Definitely snap on. Right now. So look, more pieces, more pieces, and look at those whole bunch of bits and everything in there. This is a good money box right here. Here it's in a husky box too. What do you think we got? More tools, but I got it's that. gonna be a complete set. Of what though? Same thing. Like socket. socket. Yeah. Oh, nice! It is complete set. Aha. Look at that. You called it. That should be good money. I bet you this box is good money. We'll definitely look this up on eBay and stuff because some tools are definitely if they're complete, they're worth selling on eBay. If they're missing a few pieces, we just flea market them because like I swear, like I look this up on eBay, it'll be fifty dollars, and I'll see this on eBay again minus one piece, and it's like twelve, and I'm like, does that little thing really make that much of a difference? I guess it does. I don't know anything about it, so we have a couple of complete sets. I guarantee it's at least I don't even want to make a guess, but I think it's a good money <laughs> box. All right, we got us another choke. What's in it this time? Fan blades, my favorite. This is just what I was looking in for. In a basket. Oh yes, definitely what I was looking for. More so, I see tools. And tools are good money. Oh, penny. For our safe. Oh, I see a Bitcoin, actually. Come here, come here, come here. Look at that big boy. This is a dollar gaming token at Lido, Stardust, Hotel, and Casino at Las Vegas. All right. <laughs> I wonder if it's still around. I don't feel like I've never heard of that one. More pennies in there. Look at all the change. Right? Another coin. Ooh, what is that? Trident 2 CLD5, U.S. Navy, first outload March 1990. Is that Navy SEAL? I feel like, look at that, you Army people tell me. CLD5, what is CLT and D5? Is that like a Navy SEAL? I feel like this storage unit has had like, I don't want to show it, but it has a name okay. on it. Okay. 
but I don't want to show like uh, I feel like this unit had like so many cool things like, a Navy SEAL the police thing the pictures of the drill like I don't know I just feel like every time we come here we find out like another backstory to somebody that is here at some point other than that we got more change there's got to be another 20 cents in there and I'm gonna keep that casino coin and that Navy SEAL thing aside and yeah that's that let's see what else is in this tote Nothing. Yeah. Books. 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 Books might have value. They're a toss up. This book looks old. Give me some money inside. Oh. What book is this really? It looks really old. Uh, the Power of Positive Thinking. Yeah, it's probably one of those like therapy books. Look. It's our house. <laughs> uh, books. 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 Books, clothes, books and clothes. Gotta be two of the most interesting things ever, right? Yeah, Not so much for me. So minus the coins, they might be have some value in the pennies and the tools. The rest of it's kind of boring. So we got us another black and yellow tote here. What's in it this time? Okay. Alrighty. Well, we got a book that says how things work. Oh God, I've always wondered how things work. We just, we found a thing earlier, remember? Now we'll know how it works. Joy. Yay. Serenity. What is this? This looks like animal hide or something, doesn't it? Yeah. Hmm. Made in ah Poland. Hmm. Gotta look that one up. Definitely. That looks cool. <gasps> More illegal contraband for California. These people are going away for a long time. Forget all the drugs we found pictures of. This is way worse here. What is that? Sterling silver, right? A hat. Hand forged everlast metal. Oh, hat. Silver. Oh, hat. This is all more pots and pans. Man, kitchen stuff in this unit. Oh, look, some knives. Definitely a murder weapon. Mm -hmm. 100%. Looks like Michael Myers stuff. Pull it out all slow. Yep. Choo, choo, choo. What is that? That's Jason. I did it wrong. I just heard something creepy over there. Yeah. I don't know what that is. pan and a little cat statue oh look a lock hmm. with no key though well more kitchen stuff not really that exciting i think we have literally probably 15 totes full of kitchen stuff for this one if i had to take a guess easily all right guys one more tote here for the trunk so let's see what we have in here this right here is pretty cool an ornament kit you make your own and you put like your pet's paw print in there People um, love that poor cat. Another cross. I, know, well, I think there's more than one animal. Because I've seen this Siamese cat. And that looked like I don't, one that was dead, or I don't know. They didn't have a real picture on it. It just had a magnet. Yeah, I don't know if this is like... You see the probe right on my that picture. Oh, never mind. It looked like something it wasn't. Come on. Maybe. What's in here? Money. Oh, nail stuff. What's your money? I know. Mm, this stuff's it's making my nose itch. Like 30 cents so far. Where's the rest why, of it? Why is there one key in the plastic bag? What does it say? Chateau. Chateau? Okay. I'm gonna put that aside just in case there's something in the trunk that needs a key. Ooh, earbuds. They're like new, aren't they? They're brand new. Guess who just had a pair of earbuds? Pills. What is, what is that? Um, Brotherhood of Carpenters. Yeah. 60 years of service. Jeez, keep that out. Wait, what fell out? Where'd it go? Here. 60 years of service. That's a long wow. time. Anything else? In the um, the driver's license. I need to get under this brown bag. Uh, so this is just... Isn't this that, like, burning stuff? Don't they burn this and, like, wave it around? And they're like, this is supposed to... Cleanse the air. You're asking the wrong one. <laughs> I don't know what this is either. Oh, Tiger Ball. Whatever. Let's get under this bag. Let's do it. I need more interesting stuff. Let's see if I don't make a mess. Yep, we made a mess. Made Good a job. Mess. That's uh, all right. <laughs> all right, here is paperwork. All paperwork. That's exciting. 
so I can go, what is that? Before I get there, we got to figure out what's in here. A little cat thing. What's in here? Uh, Hoping that actually is it dental shoes? shoes? No. What is it? Not sure. Um, jewelry? This, it might be jewelry because I see a hand down here. Uh, Ow. Step on my foot. Sorry, sorry. So this is how you display the rings or bracelets. Let's see what we have in here. Nothing. Ooh. Uh oh. Did we finally hit the jackpot? Did we finally find the jewelry? Sterling or white gold. This says. God, this sucks trying to read this. Um, if you can't do it, let me see it. I think it says 925, but definitely check that. I'll check this one. Hmm. This is clear 925 in here, but it feels very light. That's all right. Look at that. Can you, can't you feel it, though? They both... I mean, they're rings. I'd say 925, but they're light. Yeah. Definitely keep them, though. All right. What else we have? What is that? See these. Hold on. Let's see Look at that first. Little bag. Silver. These look like just fake earrings. No, they're silver. Don't say How that. Do you get it out of the bag. Dang. Mm, not a chance. You sure? Eight dollars. Okay, I'm sure now. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Pull some other things out. Containers. Keep tossing aside. I'm not tossing aside. About your angel. This says this is a, a cross that's jade. It has a forty dollar price tag on it. Nice. These um, are angels, by the way. This. They're quartz angels. Cool. This is a fifteen dollar price tag. Where's the gold? This right here. These feel kind of heavy. They only have five dollar bluebird carrying pocket. Um, this thing carnelian. What did I say? Five dollars? Yeah. Alright. This stuff up here. Here's another ring. Oh, cool. It's like a five on it, though. No. We want gold. I don't think it's going to have any marking in here. That one's if like anything, copper. it's only five dollars because of the stones. But I don't know what the stones are. Not sure. Like orange color. Mm, this is a little cat thing. And a bracelet. What is that? So, I mean. Oh, there's multiple ones? It's a magnetic yeah. thing. Oh. So, oh. All these black things is like the magnetic thing. But, oh, fun. Yeah, I don't think that has like high value at all. Let's see what we have. We want down gold. Here. Ooh, this is another elephant. People have been blowing us up. Literally, I yeah. think we got like 53 messages in the same night we put out the video about the elephant. So, Ooh. we're trying to figure out what to do with the elephants, guys. So, I don't know what exactly this is supposed to be used for, but it has a little slit in the middle. Alright. More... Big money, big money, big money, big money. Navy the silver. Earrings. Let's say anything. Yeah. A cat. Oh, this feels cheap. I don't think it's gonna be anything. These or this ring. What is this had a price tag right there. You can check that. All right. It's a dragon. Though. Look at that. These earrings have a fifteen dollar price tag. Can you get it to focus on the dragon? Oh, look at that. That's so cool. Mm. Nothing. Beep, 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 beep. Look what I see in the box. Is this a Rolex. What? I said Rolex. Where? No, I'm just saying. Oh. That's what I want it to be. Oh, freaking stones. Stones. Get out of here. I had some weight in it too. I was kind of excited. This? Crystals and gift gallery. This is $40 over this is. Another box. A little ring in there that has a $40, $40 price tag. tag on it. So does this. $40 Did you price open tag this on one? as well. Kinda. Earrings. Yeah, it has to do all with the stone though. I don't know what the stone that is. I don't know. I don't know. Well, let me make 
sure. This is gonna be silver. Please. No. This is seventy nine dollars. This uh, is silver. Is it? Yes. Sweet. Nine two five on the inside and it has weight. Um, this is nothing. You know what? I'm gonna just show everything that ends up being real on the giant recap on the second channel. Yes. You guys are gonna have to come back and see on the second <laughs> channel, so make sure you're subscribed. Let's get into that chest. So we finally got to the final chest of the storage unit, and look at this, it has a master lock on it. Whatever's in there is obviously worth a lot of money to these people. So let's try to figure out how to get in there, because you saw how much trouble that little lock gave me. What do you think we're supposed to do against this big mama right here? How are we supposed to get that off? Where's the key you found a few minutes ago? Um, should be over here. Do should we have that? Uh, right there on the brown bag. Aha! Nope, there it is. This is what it came for. Oh, not quite. Well, give us a couple minutes. Maybe this? Give me that. Right, let's break it. <laughs> Try to jam it. Oh, I thought it just popped. I was like, no way. Yeah, this isn't going to work. Is it oh. breaking the knife or did it break? Yeah, it broke the knife. Dang. Well, guys, you're going to have to give us some time, but we'll figure out how to get in here somehow. All right, so I'm feeling a little bit stupid right now. I want you to just notice something. It locked, right? But if you look under the lock, look. Notice anything special there? How I like, you know, it's not even attached. The top's not even attached to the bottom. Yeah. You ready to see what's in there? Of course. Three, two. Wait, one. wait. Don't yeah. forget to like and subscribe, guys. We're Do getting into this chest. Right now. I thought I just locked somehow. All right, this looks weird. What are these bears? Okay. <laughs> um, let me cover their name up. You see that? Yep. Yeah, that? Probably an animal. Ooh, I hope it's an animal. Look at this, a giant jar of marbles. Some marbles are worth a lot of money. I don't know if these are it. But, giant jar of marbles. Let's see what's in the files though. Property of, not anymore. Let's see. Let's see, paper, 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 no excitement there. Empty baggie, empty, empty. What's in here? Just more paperwork? Oh, no, 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 no. You're despicable Daffy Duck stuff in here. Money, right? No. Uh, not seeing nothing there. This isn't looking good right now. Paper. What about this one? Uh, dental paperwork. Also not very exciting. Uh, papers. A penny. It's a 1987. Not fun. Uh, we got giant posters or something. This, I don't know what the papers are. I got a trophy for something. What do you think it's for? I don't know what that is. The top angel? Maybe. I guess so. It's really old though looking to me at least. Yeah. Look at the bottom too. Definitely looks like it has some age to it. Hmm. Jump. Learn Tai Chi. Um, folders, and nothing. This is it, right? All full of cash. Mm -hmm. All cash money right here. It's all paperwork. No. Oh look, more rocks. So we have a lot of rocks These there. These are more like gems, yeah. Yeah. Some gems. Looks like amethyst. Alright. Wasn't what I was expecting in here, but it's something, I guess. What are these? This is where it's at. Open. Open. Look. There's little cards that all say different. They're like prayer cards. Alright. Well, look at that. What is this? An old bottle? Is that a candle? An electric candle. Okay. I feel like this was made into that. Uh, 
Um, hey, look, it's the part of the chest that was broken, it looks like. <laughs> look at this. Comic book people? Value? I don't think it's worth anything because the price on it is $2.50, so it's not that old. But maybe. Bunch of change in here, just pennies. But other than that, guys, this trunk was kind of a bust unless those marbles or comic book or worse something other than that i think it was a bust all right guys so just got back home from that 10 by 10 unit we're finally done with that unit except for some bags of trash and of course the personal items which we will return to the office but i did want to clarify something as far as the recap we said that was going to be on the second channel we're actually going to do the recap here on Treasure Hunter with Jeebus, but if you want to see a more in-depth um, search of the totes that we didn't get to towards the end of the unit, go over to the second channel. I think you guys will really like the in-depth searches if you haven't seen them already. So go subscribe to the second channel if you would please and let us know what you think. So that's going to be it for this video guys. If you did enjoy it, leave it a big fat thumbs up. If you're not already, hit that subscribe button for awesome Treasure Hunter videos all the time. If you do want to follow us on our social media links are on screen or click the links down in the description below. Make sure you follow us on whatever you have. Thank you so much for watching and until next time, peace out.